Okay, we have to calculate the cell potential after the complex ion formation. So this is related to complex ion and electrochemistry. So this is this question you can say this is related to electrochemistry and you must have some idea of complex ion formation that is complex formation. If you have these two idea that is a chapter of ion equilibria complex formation and then you can solve this one. Let us see what this says initially E degree is given for this cell reaction Zn plus Cu2 plus and this gives you Zn2 plus and plus Cu. So this is given E degree for this cell is given to you 1.1 volt. Now when this is E degree a standard this has to be 1 m and this is also 1 m. So concentration of this is 1 m. Now the question says sufficient amount of NH3 added to make the final concentration of NH3 is 2 m. So finally NH3 concentration is 2 m. So what we are doing is in this solution, this solution contains Zn2 plus and Cu2 plus. So this contains Zn2 plus uh, one side this is only added in copper cathodic compartment that is a copper 2 plus compartment so this is NH3 has been added to copper 2 plus compartment so we have added NH3 and now what will happen if you add NH3 Cu2 plus will combine with NH3 and it will form complex because the complex and formation constant is given that is also another hint so you see what will happen so once you add NH3 for NH3 if you add now this will form complex ion so this is Cu2 plus so it will form Cu NH3 whole twice and this is 2 plus so this is a complex ion formation constant is very high 10 to the power 12 so this value is 10 to the power 12 now what this suggests this formation constant is very high suggests this reaction will go to the completion this is the important point so I can say Kf is very high very high this means reaction will go to the completion so reaction will go in the forward direction so reaction goes to completion so this is another important point goes to completion completion means it completes so reaction goes to completion now you see what happens final concentration of NH3 is 2M. So you add NH3, you add NH3, it react with Cu2 plus but finally concentration of solution of NH3 this is 2M. So concentration of NH3 is 2M. This means I must have added more than 2 mole because some of the NH3 has been reacted with copper 2 plus and this has gone this side. Now one can tell me how many mole of extra NH3 had been added because Initially this was 1 mole, 1 m, Cu2 plus was 1 mole. So almost all of the Cu2 plus has been reacted and it has formed Cu and H3 whole twice plus. So this means this must have 1 mole because all this Cu2 plus initial is here is now formed Cu and H3 complex ion has been formed. So one can ask what is the number of mole of ammonia that has been added. This is basically 4, this is not 2. So one can ask a question what is the mole of ammonia that has been added. So 4 mole of ammonia has that is complexed because 1 mole of this so 4 mole of ammonia and 2 mole of ammonia is free. So 6 mole of ammonia is basically has been added. So ammonia exists in two form free ammonia that is the free NH3 that is the 2 mole per liter let us say solution volume is 1 liter so I can say this is 2 mole and the combined NH3 so this is combined NH3 that is with complex ion this is 4 mole so one can ask a good question what is the total mole of ammonia added so I can say 6 mole of ammonia has been added in this case so you can say 6 mole of NH3 has been added has been added are you getting now let us say 
how to find Cu2 plus but this reaction is a equilibrium reaction some of the Cu and H3O this complex will dissociate in this direction and this will give you let us say x mole of copper 2 plus so now I can calculate the copper 2 plus equilibrium constant is 10 to the power 12 and this is equals to this into so this is simply 1 and divided by x into and S3 2 raised to the power 4 so because coefficient is 4 so this is 2 raised to the power 4 so what is the value of x x is very small value so 1 by 2 to the power 4 that is 16 into 10 to the power minus 12 this is x that is basically copper 2 plus so now I know copper 2 plus concentration of copper 2 plus that is 1 by 16 I into 10 to the power minus 12 are you getting now if I know the copper 2 plus using this reaction I can calculate E cell because Zn2 plus remains 1m so now E cell is E cell we can write easily E cell is equals to E degree minus 0 0.0592 this divided by n and log of this side we have Zn2 plus divided by Cu2 plus Zn2 plus concentration and this divided by Cu2 plus concentration are you getting now Zn2 plus is 1m because there is no change initially degree is 1.1 volt minus 0 0.0592 and if you write reaction you will find in this case number of mole is 2 and log Zn2 plus is 1 and copper 2 plus is this 1 by 16 so 16 goes up and 10 to the power minus 12 is the denominator so you can write this becomes 1.1 into 0 0.0592 this divided by 2 and this is simply log 16 let us apply log a minus b so this is log 16 minus 12 so if I take the minus sign in so I will have 1.1 plus 0 0.0592 so this is 0 0.0592 this divided by 2 and this minus becomes plus minus log 16 now this calculation we can do let us say what is the value of log 16 so I have log so this is log and 16 so log 16 is how much 1.204 so log 16 is 1.204 so this is 1.204.0592 divided by 2 and 12 minus 1.204 let me check again this value is 1.204 now let us do this calculation so if I do this calculation 1.1 minus I will have 0.0592 divided by 2 0.0592 divided by 2 and then I have to have, to have 12 minus 12 minus 1.204 I have to make two brackets so I think uh, I think this is fine let us check this one uh, somewhere some mistake I have done this calculation calculator is not okay let us do calculation in two ways or simplified way so first 12 minus 1.20 12 minus 1.204 and this comes out to be 10.795 so let us copy this value and paste it here and multiply this value by 0 0.0592 so 0 0.0592 and this value divided by 2 so multiplied and then divide by 2 so what is the answer 0 0.3195 so this is 0 0.3195 are you getting so this is 0 0.395 I think somewhere I have done some mistake or not a uh, point ah uh, there is a mistake basically this is to be plus because log a minus of log b so minus minus plus this will become plus this is plus so let us say you can verify yourself this is minus and this is minus are you getting and what about log 16 log 16 is ok log 16 is ok so I think I have to do calculation again 
so I have to do this calculation again so let us do again so minus 12 so let us add 12 plus 1.204 1.204 and this value is this and this multiplied by so let us copy this this multiplied by 0 0.0592 and this divided by 2 so this value is 0.39 with a minus sign so this is 0.39 with a minus sign so 1.1 minus 0.39 so what is this value so let us check 1.1 minus 0.39 1.1 minus 0.39 so this value is 0.71 so this voltage is 0 0.71 volt are you getting well important point this this time i have done a mistake you can verify yourself so this value is i can log a i can write extra line that is 1.1 minus 0 0.05 so log 16 minus log b so minus minus plus because minus 12 this will become plus and if i take minus inside this is minus this is already minus so that will give you 7.1 volt so i will have the same answer here let us check this one yeah this is 7.1 volt so important point we have in this reaction sufficient amount of NH3 has been added so that the final concentration of free NH3 is 2M. So if I know the final concentration of free NH3, I know the concentration of this because almost all of the CO2 plus has been formed here. So if I know this, I know this, I can calculate free CO2 plus and now things are easy. Just plug the value of CO2 plus, get the heat cell. So this is the E cell. So less than E degree. So now E cell is basically 0 0.71 volt and this is less than E degree cell. E degree cell was basically 1.1 volt. So this means I can say complex ion formation decreases the E cell. So adding NH3. So now I can say adding NH3 to the cathodic compartment to the CO2 plus compartment, CO2 plus compartment decreases, decreases, decreases the EMF of cell, EMF of cell. So this is important. 